it's Angela Irene with Aged Goodness. Thank you so much for being here today. We have the next video in the February sales series. I, I know you're reading that correctly. Done, 7, 9 of 20. Mom processed this box for us. This box has been here for two years. February 5th, 2020 is when it came in. And she processed it for us in July. And it's boho, so we know that. Uh, unfortunately, I can't find any numbers on the outside, so I don't know how much it weighs, but we'll see if oh, if there's a tag still on the inside. And for those of you who don't know, my mom processes these for us. She cleans them, sorts them. Wow. Okay, this is going to be very bracelet heavy, I can tell already. And then she puts things like this together, kind of like like and kind for us. And then, oh, patented press and seal, I can see it in there. And then I'll go ahead and open it up. We'll put some price tags on it and we'll get this moving along. Let's start this box with the earrings. We have three beautiful pairs. Each one of the first three are each a dollar. We have these gorgeous shells. I mean, you can just... That shimmer goes all the way through. These look like, almost like sea glass, don't they? They have a beautiful glow to them. And of course, all three are on the French hooks. And these beads look like um, like composite, almost like composite turquoise. It looks very interesting. And nice articulation on that. Each one is a dollar. And these last three are just simply amazing, 618. Looks like these beautiful women. Look at all of the detail put into this. And these feel almost like that, uh, like they're clay. Aren't these gorgeous? These are $2. These are older looking style cloisonne. That flower with the ruby red and the blue. These are older. These are $3. And 620. These posts. Uh, the fish hooks come kind of almost like a post, like a, they don't have a bend to them. They're marked 925 on the underneath uh, of the bend. And there is kind of a mark. I, it's like a jeweler's mark. I just can't read it. I can't make it out. And it does look like we have um, perhaps dyed howlite, and these possibly could be uh, turquoise. They could be, you know, simulated. I'm not sure, but uh, they are marked 925 with a maker's mark underneath, and those are gorgeous. And that is 620, and those are four dollars. All right, let's start with 621 of this group. It is going to be the two beautiful hair pieces. This one has got the floral, um, oh, more like a, an ivy scroll going to it, gold tone. This one with almost kind of like a love knot, endless knot design. The silver tone is marked made in France and is, you know what, they both have a nice little weight to them. So both of those together are $2. 622, this stretch ring has kind of like this snake skin kind of look to it and kind of like that brass look. It's $1, 622. 623, this thing is really, really cool looking. It is a five and three quarter. This lion head has these really stunning blue uh, rhinestone eyes. It's done kind of like in the copper and brass. It's kind of like throughout it, so it has kind of like a high and low in the color. It is a hefty piece. Obviously, it's a fashion piece. It's $2, 623. 624 is this three-piece set. Looks like we have artisan wire wrapping on some form of brown stone. And then there is this cool looking gray stone drilled, ready to be a pendant. And this is kind of a pendant with this acorn looking bead here. So you're gonna get all three of them for $3. Uh, but really, that that's some beautiful work right here in that in that wire wrapping, and that's six two four. Okay, six two five is a duo. This one has both acrylic beads on the stretch, and glass beads on the stretch, and they just look so 
good together. I thought they'd be a great pair. So this duo is $6.25 for $2. $6.26. This dyed shell is 8 inches. Love this peach color we've got going on here. Peach and kind of that off-white. That is a dollar. I'm going to say 627 is an anklet. It is 10 inches. And we have that purple dyed shell. Reminds me very much of amethyst. And it is also one dollar. Telling you this box had some great <laughs> pieces. All right, this one is six and a half inches. Looks like dyed some form of uh, dyed stone. It's got a lot of uh, beautiful movement with the different sizes. The gold spacer beads. It's a really pretty little piece. It's a dollar. 629 is eight and three quarters. It is a toggle. It has a nicer weight on the actual chain. And then kind of this cheapy little, you know, medallion here. I'm not sure why it's here maybe to carve the initials or something but i'd take that off personally it doesn't match the caliber of the rest of the chain frankly it's a dollar six three zero oh i like this piece very much it is seven to eight inches with the toggle and the little extender here so you can make it eight inches or seven to me these look like pieces of jasper here's the back you can see they are glued in place but look at the beautiful color and it goes so nicely with this like antiqued gold it is three dollars okay this is the little star of the show here 631 i'm not an overall fan of these glass beads they're pretty and all but the closure pieces the toggle pieces here uh, they look a little almost almost kind of art deco-y to me they have a great little look uh, the bar is marked 925 and they have a little bit of patina as soon as I saw it they look like sterling so this really here these I would repurpose these beads and I would take these pieces and put nicer beads with them I mean it, they're just these are beautiful findings they just are uh, 631 that is six dollars and more boho fun all right these three bracelets are just all about i mean just cool boho uh, this one has the wooden closure the stretch on the beads these i mean the closures are definitely worth buying that way you can do whatever you wanted i mean if you wanted a more uh, upscale look or something more bold than these and you can certainly do that that's a dollar this is a stretch bracelet look at all of the wonderful colors I mean talk about fun and sassy for spring that is a dollar and this one is just full-on fabulous it has all wooden beads and then the coconut uh, rounds I mean that is so fun it's of course it again is all kinds of sassy great spring color it's a dollar as well and the bracelets keep coming this one is multi-strand small glass i think they're glass they feel nice and cool seed beads nice stretch and then the center focal here are the heavier beads and then just this whole plethora i mean just look at all that movement it's beautiful it's a dollar and 636 okay this is a toggle someone made this bracelet it's eight and a half inches it's pokey as all get out I, you i mean ugh, i'm not sure what they were doing here but look at all these beads i mean this is a definite take apart and make some beautiful jewelry so 636 a dollar uh, of course we had some metal all right these two bangles we're going to do together one is brass one is a gold tone uh the brass one it has these nice little etchings almost looks like wings and I'm not sure what all is here uh, but this one is a tad over two and a half inches in diameter and this really pretty like diamond cut one is right at two and a half inches so we're going to do those two together for a dollar and the 638 this little cuff is two and a half inches and one inch opening uh, just shy of two and a half inches and we've got this yellow and blue here 
It is a dollar. 639 is a mother of pearl clamper. It's silver tone. It's two and a half inches by one and three quarter inches. And look at that mother of pearl. Has a lot of good life left in it. And it is also a dollar. The last two in this group. This is a silver toned hammer. Hammered look here. This one has like the little kind of circle cutout thing here. It's not the heart. And this one is two and five eighths in the diameter. So it has a little bit bigger. That one is a dollar. And six four one. My gosh, this one is so cool with the brass tone and the silver tone. Looks like there was a sticker in here. And then here, of course, you know, we have almost like these kind of like teeth kind of looking or claws like crab claws. It's a really interesting looking piece. There's a lot of dimension going on in here. This one is two and a half inches across and one and five eighths for this opening. And this one is four dollars. It's six four one. Okay, this next set features the necklace the bracelet that needs a little help, and the matching earrings. We have this beautiful silver tone. These beads have some great diamond cutting, and these maybe are magnesite. They've got the darker veining. We have the rhinestone rondelles. The necklace is 20 and a half inches. The bracelet is missing the end. So we have the lobster claw on the one end, you just need to attach as long of a chain as you need to make the bracelet or anklet. And then the beautiful earrings with the French hooks. So the entire set, including the bracelet, which needs the repair, $6. It's six four two. Okay, this next pair, I'm telling you, an artisan did a lot of work here. Uh, the bracelet is eight and a quarter inches and i think that takes into consideration how kind of chunky this is i'm going to say probably more like an eight and the necklace has the same configuration in 24 inches so you have these wooden beads and these acrylic beads that have been individually pinned and they are kind of like this cranberry red they are so pretty and then again you have the same thing going on. I think from being in the box, this needs to be, you know, kind of like, uh, kind of like zhuzhed around a little bit to get everything to settle back down. But if you only take it for these, I mean, these are already pinned and then you make something else with them. Uh, not beautiful acrylic, gorgeous cranberry color. $3 will take both home. Item 643. Moving on to 644, 29 and a half inches of acrylic goodness. This necklace has beautiful neutrals. And then all of a sudden we have some little bit darker veining here on these larger beads. This piece really is a stunning statement piece and it would make a great layering piece. I want to find a good home for it. Can I ask $2? Item 644. Item 645, two piece set. We have a plastic bangle, but this bangle looks so good with the colors of these beads. And let's talk about the beads. We have 20 inches of the rubber, beautiful floral beads. It's on a stretch and, you know, to me, I think I would put it on something else because it's starting to look like it's a little too stretched, but these beads are absolutely gorgeous. And they do go great with that. I think you could make a full set out of this. Item 645 is $2. Okay, item 646. This is 29 to 31 inches with the extender. Uh, this one is, you know, a pretty simple, straightforward, almost kind of looks like a little beach necklace. With these colors, it's great for spring. Uh, we've got the shell and the acrylic beads can't go wrong with those. It's a dollar. It's 646. 647 is 20, excuse me, it's 18 and a quarter inches of nice cool beads. I think they're glass. Then we have these, the three focal points that I think are acrylic. And I tell you what, this one, I, I really think this one stands beautifully by itself, but because of the length, 
I uh, think it'll layer with quite a bit. It's two dollars. It's six four seven. And this next piece is kind of like a bib style. The necklace itself, which is kind of like in this antique bronzed color, is twenty inches. And then the drop with all the dangles is between seven and a half, um, between seven and seven and a half. And it features like some enameling, uh, just some really cool looking floral kind of pieces. And I mean, it has a beautiful clankability. But look at all this great stuff that's in here. And, I mean, if you really wanted to, you could add an extender and make it longer than the 20 inches. But it is a beautiful bib style. It's six four eight three dollars Okay, item 649 This definitely has some great clinkability to it. This necklace is 18 to 21 inches. The leaves are silver tone and kind of like a muted gold tone and copper tone. With that clankability and all the different variations of the leaves, it really is a lot of fun. It is lightweight, easy to wear. It's one dollar. Six five zero is two dollars. This reminds me very much of I don't know, maybe something like Lord of the Rings. It's heavy, it's chunky. To me, it looks like it could be polished. I don't know. It just sort of is taking on kind of a patina. You know, it almost looks silver. It's kind of cool. It's 18 to 22 inches. I mean, here is the extender. Here is the hang tag. It's the matching leaf. It is a, you know, a hook closure. Let me get that back in there and look at the heavy chain. And like I said, it just has that patina. I mean, it really has a great look to it. It's two dollars. It's six five zero. Item 651. This piece is 26 inches. It features wooden beads. There is no closure, so this would be over the head. And then this beautiful representation of a cross. This is a dollar. 652. It's also a dollar. This has, I don't know if this is like a hemp cord. It feels like a, um, yeah, you know, kind of a sturdy cord, but thin, so they always make me a little nervous. The closure features this piece of mother of pearl or shell. It's dyed, of course. It, the overall piece is 20 and a half inches. It features multi-strand down here, looks like man-made gem, and these glass iridescent beads. It's dainty, but really, really pretty. It's also a dollar. Okay, the set on 653, we have a 24 inch necklace and a six and a half to seven and a quarter inch matching bracelet. So we have this beautiful silver tone chain. And then in here we have glass beads, both in kind of that uh, sea, kind of that sea blue. Uh, we've got this AB glass, looks like either created or natural mother of pearl. And then we have some acrylic beads. I mean, just look at this. Is that not beautiful? It's gorgeous. And then we have the same configuration in this bracelet. It is a beautiful set. Someone did an absolutely gorgeous job. It is 653. It's $5. Okay, this next duo, 654, is $4. This is a little over 15 and a half inches. It's definitely going to be more like a collar, choker kind of thing. Um, we have almost, they look like liquid silver uh, beads, but they're not. And the stones certainly look like serpentine to me. And then the matching earrings have the same stones. Uh, beautiful set. It's $4 for the pair. These next two pieces, they're just fun. This, again, this one has no closure. It's just over the head. This one is 26 inches and has some of the sparkliest acrylic beads, which is so cool looking. Um, you know, it's kind of an, kind of an A-line, not really an A-line, sorry, asymmetrical, it's getting light, uh, type look to it. 
but this yellow is so cool looking. And then you've got wooden beads. I mean, this is just really a pretty piece. It's a dollar, and 656 is also a dollar. We had earrings in the very beginning that look eh, similar to these, but it looks like somebody did a lot of nice work here. And, you know, just has that kind of like toggle closure. And it's very artisan made, very boho. It's also a dollar. This beauty is 21 inches, silver tone. I'm, I'm telling you, these look like real Arabic coins. It has a great clink. I know the minute I pick it up, I'm never going to get it to lay out this way again. Uh, it's $8. I mean, it has got heft, beauty. I mean, this piece is just full on gorgeous bib style but you know you're going to be wearing it because you know it is heavy so you're going to feel it okay so it's not like the heaviest but it's not lightweight either okay so just keep it in mind it's eight dollars it's number 657 658 has to be an artisan creation because this is so unique and so cool it is 19 inches with this black chain and then we have these individually attached acrylics like a smoky bead and then we have these gold and brown pieces uh, they're lighter weight and then we have another drop down here with these little tiny gold leaves look at this Let's see if i can't get this like this you can see the colors down here this is such a unique piece. It is so, so cool. A an artisan had to have created that. Mixed and matched pieces. And you know what? $2, item 658. We saw something very similar to 659 earlier. Uh, and this one is in green. Uh, someone took the time to attach all of these acrylic beads it is unbelievable to me this piece is 17 and a half inches to 20 inches with that nice generous extender look at all of this green look at um, if green is your color this one is so for you i mean this is so spring it's not even funny it's also two dollars it's six five nine folks i have never found a button necklace like this this is so funky fabulous i love this thing it is over 60 inches and even in that length they've given you a lobster claw uh look at this let me pull these through these are like mother of pearl cat's eye fan freaking tastic look at all of them just look at all of these buttons I mean, I can't even imagine how much these buttons would cost for 60 inches of them. But look at this. This is such, it almost looks like candy. This is so funky, so cool. I love this thing. You could certainly knot it up. I mean, you could layer it. You can do just about what would you want to. You could wear this as a belt, gang, because you've got this little closure. Um, these are fabulous. I've never seen it. I looked up some pricing. <gasps> um, yeah, okay, buttons are in, I guess. Holy moly. All right, gang, this is going to be $5. It's item number 660. And number 661, this necklace is by Magnabilities, and we have two of the magnetic discs. This one reminds me of kind of like cherry blossoms a little bit with the red and the gold and the pink and white. And this one has the purple, uh, kind of like a, with a vine running through it. I mean, these are great. The necklace is marked with the, the um, a little hang tag up here. It's marked on the back here. And then you simply take the disc and you just snap it in. And I had no idea how expensive these were until we saw them in a trade show. Oh my, I'm glad you get two of them. This is 661. This little set here is $5. Yeah, item 662. This still has its tags. It's Genuine Sonoma Jean Company. It says Kohl's, $12. Oi. Uh, we've got some like lightweight wood 
and then these stations that have like acrylic and then mother of pearl so it looks like unfinished so it has that great kind of rustic look to it it's really pretty uh, it's two dollars item 663 it has a hang tag but there's nothing written on it it is 35 to 38 inches multi strand um, so you have all of this chain and then it comes down to like would be like you know a little past your collarbone um, the two flowers this one however they have these great orange rhinestones this one because it's like molded in there is molded more to the side than it is in the center so i'm that's why the price is going to reflect that and then you have more chain down here i mean really this piece i would harvest all of the chain and take this one um i don't know maybe you could bend it i don't really think so it doesn't really feels pretty sturdy uh, i'd take it uh, for the parts and if not it's not very noticeable you could totally wear this just the way it is it is item 663 and it's two dollars all right let's talk about this one it's marked uno de 50. i have taken a look at this brand and holy toledo again i am not sure what on earth they're doing but um yeah okay it's marked here and it's marked here i don't know if these are tarnished like looking silver pieces this is definitely leather you can see how it's going to go between six and seven and three quarter it does look like it has been worn you can see here that obviously somebody had it right here for a long time uh it i mean all the leather on the interior all looks good um, you know, the buckle seems to be functioning properly. And I found the same piece. Uh, you know, it's like 150 bucks used. I don't, you know what, gang, you know me. I got a good deal on this box. I just want somebody to love it. Uh, I'm going to ask 18 because I haven't seen anything close in that price range. So I think it'll be a good deal for you. Um, if you're a flipper, you know, I mean, here you go. This is item number 664. Okay, this one, 665, this is $3. Let me tell you, this. there's a lot going on here. On the shortest strand, the yellow, it is 20 inches. So it will extend a little past that. This one, again, we have that wooden toggle closure here. This one has a few light scratches, and it's probably from being in that bag. Um, I mean, they're not bad. I mean, kind of, maybe, they're hard to pick up with the camera, almost right there. Um, you know, I, yeah, they're really hard to see, but maybe even a little pledge, some furniture polish, I think we'll do that just fine. Uh, there are 14 strands of colorful beads that will be draping on the decollete. Um, they are gorgeous. I mean, and the color variety that they chose, it really is striking. It's a beautiful piece. And the entire thing is $3. It's item number 665. We're going to skip a number and now we're at 667. Uh, this piece is 16 and a quarter inches. We have these great, bright, vibrant, painted wooden beads. And then this pendant has that Melifiore look in it feels like clay which is so neat and it's lighter weight i think it's perfect for layering or just wearing by itself it's one dollar i really hope this comes off better in the color on my monitor that i'm looking at right now these look very blue these are very you know robin's egg kind of teal blue going on and these have actual greens so i really hope that comes across in the monitors for you this multi-strand piece is $2. It is 18 inches to 21 inches with a nice extender. Has all of these great different shaped seed beads. And then we have these different acrylic beads. I mean, they're just a plethora of beautiful beads. And then there is the strand of these dyed shell beads. And oh, they are gorgeous. And then there's even wooden beads. I mean, this necklace look at this i mean you want to talk about nice power piece i think this one would be amazing with a suit 
Uh, or if you don't like the configuration, look at all the beads. I mean, these ones kind of look like dyed halite, but it is in that uh, acrylic. And these kind of have almost like, um, not really a cat's eye, but some of them sort of do. I mean, you know, that, I love this piece. Can you tell? I know. All right, I'll stop talking now. It's $2. 669. This, oh, I love this piece too. It's 24 inches. We have all of these tiny black seed beads. And then you come down to the three fashion beads with the power coat, you know, the power colors of that red and that blue and that black. And then you come down to, again, a ton of these beads and someone has knotted it at the bottom. Uh, you know, I haven't tried, but I think you could totally uh, unknot it and have it be even longer if you wanted to. But this piece, someone took a lot of time, you know, or a manufacturer, they spent a lot of money on a ton of beads. It's $2, it's six six nine. We have another multi-strand. This one is gonna be 18 to 20 and one half inches with that nice extender. Again, we've got wooden beads. We have the different color beads. We have glass beads. This one has some beautiful glazed glass beads. And you know the colors, they're not just for fall. I mean, I think with any neutral, oh my gosh, that would be just gorgeous. Jeans, white t-shirt, and this, I like it. It's $2. Okay, 671. This is a great leather little bracelet it's six to seven and a half depending on how you do the buckles it really doesn't look like it has a bunch of wear the little flowerette is really beautifully made um, some of these the strap is so thick it's not really comfortable this one has a very very thin strap so I think if you know that had bothered you in the past, I think it would be okay this time around. It's two dollars at six seven one. All right, guys, in six seven two, this set is five dollars. We've got the beautiful eighteen and a quarter inch necklace. We have this great drop here, and then the matching earrings. Okay, these look like you know baroque and keshi pearls. Nothing here is overly gritty, so you know I don't know. We're gonna sell it as costume jewelry if they happen to be real. Hey, that's exciting. Uh, if they aren't, it's a beautiful, beautiful representation. Look at the color. I mean, you know what? I'm just right now with pearls and all that has come out with, you know, faux pearls and everything. Let's just sell it as costume jewelry. If you get a heck of a deal, you get a heck of a deal. And I'm very, very happy for you. Uh, but look at this. This is just gorgeous no matter what it is. It's $5 for the pair. It's six seven two, And then we have 673 This is $8. It's 2 pounds, 8 ounces. It has everything from glass beads to shell, whole pieces, ceramic, some absolutely gorgeous wooden pieces, uh, leather, You've got great chevrons. There's some chain. You know, uh, single earrings. A little bit of everything in here, including some whole pieces. Six, seven, three, eight dollars. That's the craft bag.